Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 7th of October 1949, the German Democratic Republic, known as East Germany, was founded in the Soviet occupied zone of Germany. The establishment of the GDR ensured that the division of Germany that had been implemented in 1945 was made permanent. West Germany had already gained independence from the occupying powers earlier in 1949, and the creation of East Germany meant the same for the former Soviet-controlled zone. Although independent, the ruling Socialist Unity Party of Germany maintained close ties with the USSR, and was therefore seen as a satellite state. The constitution that was adopted by the government of the GDR bore striking similarities to the Weimar Constitution of 1919 and was based largely on a draft written from 1946 that was intended for a united Germany. Consequently, a new constitution was adopted in 1968 that more accurately reflected the socialist government of the country. The position of head of state was originally taken by Wilhelm Pieck, who was president until his death in 1960. In reality, authority lay with the general secretary of the Socialist Unity Party, who, in 1950, was Walter Ulbricht, who had lived in exile in France and the USSR until the defeat of the Nazis. On Pieck's death, the office of president was dissolved and was replaced by the state council. Since the chairman position was commonly held by the general secretary, this gave Ulbricht and his successors ultimate power in the GDR. Following 1989's peaceful revolution and the fall of the Berlin Wall, East Germany experienced the first truly democratic elections that dramatically reduced the power of the Socialist Unity Party and led to the reunification of Germany that took place on the 3rd of October 1990.